Hi everyone, I'm Vicky. How are you doing? Today I would like to introduce uh, Japanese hiragana. Ah, okay, today it is our episode 3. Today I would like to share two words uh, with everyone. One is Ame. If you are interested to learn the kanji, let's write together. Isho ni Yeah, let's write together. Okay, this is the kanji for ame. Moikai, one more time. Ame. Ideska? Ame. Okay, another word I would like to share with you is Aki. Aki. This is the kanji. Okay. All right. Moikai. Let's write one more time. Aki. Yes. So, hiragana. A. Okay. Is it better for me to put down the omaji for you just in case you are very beginners? Ne? Ame. M E. Ame. All right. Aki. K, K I. Ne? Aki. Aki. This is the kanji for Aki. This is the kanji for Ame. Ne? In case if you have heard of uh, Ame, ne? it's exactly the same uh, hiragana, but the pronunciation is the upper tone. Ame, that's candy. All right, so this is the two word I would like to share with you. Ame, Aki, Ideska. Okay, next, so using by using these two words, I would like to share Another two very useful word. Let's make sentences with this name. Okay, so one of the verb I would like to share with you is uh, furu. Ne? furu. Okay, my lu is not that perfect. Ne? Let's write one more time. Ne? Just now we had ame, right? For example, ame ga. Ga is our particle, ne? Ame ga futemasu. Ame ga futeimasu. Okay, ame ga futeimasu. Okay, over here we have the verb. Fulu, fulu change to teiru. Yeah, over here, teiru is like doing. All right. So, fulu change to teiru. Teimas. You change the. There's a small t here. So, kuom. Yeah. Ame ga futeimas. All right. So, in case you are interested to. Uh, learn the kanji for this one. Furu. Ne? Furu. This is the kanji. Alright. So I will write uh, one more time. Oh! <laughs> You sometimes when I write too slow, have you, do you have this experience? When you write too slow, it becomes kind of strange. Ne? All right, fulu, ne? fulu, fulu, ne? fulu change to teiru, ne? plus teiru, teiru means doing. Futemas, ame ga futemas. It's raining, yeah, it's raining. All right. Okay, and just now we had Aki. 
This one I will erase, ne? いいですか Aki, yeah, just now I introduced Aki. Aki, autumn. 皆さん、秋が好きですか Aki. So another word I would like to share. 好き。好き、it's not adjective, ね。好き。Okay, this is the kanji. Actually, the left side, this is this this kanji. Ne? This is the kanji for suki. Suki. Okay, so if you separate these two, actually, the left side is onna. Have you learned this kanji? Onna. Ne? Female. Onna. Female. Then the right side is ko. Kodomo no ko. ね、子供の子。Okay? 子。子 is like, like child. Yeah? So you put these two together. ね、you put these two together. Plus, ki, suki. ね、this in Chinese is actually means good. Good. Suki. ね、suki. Like. Suki. いいですか Suki. ね、like so just now we were talking about aki ne? do you still remember the kanji about aki ne? aki this is the kanji for aki ne? just now aki aki ga suki desu yeah so for example aki ga let's use the kanji here ne? Aki ga suki desu. Ne? Suki desu. By plus this, it becomes the polite style. Ne? Ga, it is our word particle. Ne? It tells us the object, then the noun, the object of like. Ne? Aki ga, our particle. Ne? Aki ga suki, suki desu. Desu ka? Aki ga suki desu. Ne? Suki desu. I'm not sure if you can hear the kaminari ne? sound actually. It's a very loud sound on my, in Singapore right now where I stay. Ne? Sound kaminari. Okay. Minasan! Aki ga suki desu ka? By plus ka. Ki e ka. You can turn this sentence to a question. Ne? Minasan, aki ga suki desu ka? Watashi wa aki ga daisuki desu. Daisuki. I like it. Ne? I like autumn very much. Ne? Nihon no aki ga sukoku kirei desu. Ne? Ne? Japan's autumn is really, really beautiful. Ne? Aki. Ne? Aki ga suki desu. I like autumn. I like autumn. All right, this is today's sharing. I hope you like this kind of sharing. Uh, if you have any question or if you have any comment, uh, please remember to um, uh, uh, write below ne, under the video. Matane, have a great day. Bye bye. Thank you for watching.